Hey guys, welcome back. Don't get on me. I wore this crew neck a few videos ago, but it's totally okay. You only live once. It's clean anyways. I just get awkward, okay? Basically, guys, in today's video, I'm going to be giving you a what's on my iPhone. I know iOS 14 just came out. I didn't do one of those crazy themes on my phone. I still have the time, and I literally don't know how people have done it. But I got a new phone, so coincidentally, I figured it'd be a good time to do what's on my iPhone. I just got the iPhone 11 in white. Thank you to my mom. Appreciate it so much. My other phone stopped. I think she's coming in here now. No, well, she's not. My other phone stopped working. It was like overheating. It was giving me a lot of issues. So we upgraded and I am forever grateful. And yeah, I did a what's on my iPhone for my iPhone X, my previous phone. The video did pretty well for a video on my channel. So hopefully this one does well too. <laughs> That being said, we're just going to get into the video. I hope you guys like it. Alright guys, so here is my iPhone. Like I said, I got the white iPhone 11. And I just have a clear OtterBox to go with it. Here is my screensaver. It's one of my favorite pictures of me and my boyfriend. And now I just am unlocking my phone, showing you guys kind of the gist of everything. The first page just has my basic apps. And then we're going to get into all my other stuff. And now we're going to kind of get into more of my apps. So like I said, here is the home screen, just the basic iPhone, Apple apps, nothing crazy. I, I never really changed this. I just kind of leave it there. Um, now I'm going to be showing you guys some of my music. I typically like hip hop, R&B, a little bit of pop. And I'm going to be showing you my um, profile. <laughs> so yeah, here it is. And I actually just read it all of my playlists, so I'm pretty proud of it. And I have like my regular favorite songs playlist, throwbacks, vibes, so it's kind of like my favorite one. And I'm showing you guys some of it now. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to keep up or not, but here are some of my favorite songs. And like I said, I also have a throwbacks one and kind of like a in my feels playlist. And yeah, my account is on private, but if you guys want to follow me on there, I'll put it on public. Not really sure if anybody wants to see my music or not but i will say i have pretty good music taste <laughs> and now i'm just showing you guys my podcast app some of my favorite youtubers do podcasts so i think that's really cool i got into them i want to say sophomore year but then i really got into them during quarantine so here are some of my favorites i love pretty basic unsolicited advice wild Tail nine Ju <laughs> tk's juicy pod they're all really good, um, but yeah, here's some of my podcast suggestions. They're really convenient for when you're driving and you don't want to listen to music or even working out and going on walks. And now we're going into my utilities group. So this is basically all of like my school apps, Gmail, all of that stuff. One really cool app that I am going to show you guys now is this app called Fetch Rewards. Basically, you can scan all of your receipts from like shopping, fast food, like really literally anything and you get points for them. And eventually when you have enough points, you can redeem them for gift cards. Shout out to my aunt, she put me onto this. And I'm kind of giving you guys a little tutorial here, but this app is so good, especially if you spend a lot of money. It's like getting money back and it's pretty darn cool. And now I'm taking you into my Instagram. So yeah guys, here's my Instagram feed. I zoomed in a little bit to help you guys. I know the lighting wasn't the best, but yeah, I'm pretty proud of it. And I've been trying to be more active on my stories. I recently set my account on public for you guys. I do a lot of polls, post a lot of inspirational quotes. So it's a pretty good time over there. Um, never really was a fan of Instagram. I was more of a Snapchat person, but I try to remain active on both of my socials to help promote with my YouTube so I could grow my channel. <laughs> and here's me taking a Snapchat and I'm gonna show you guys around a little bit, but yeah, I was filming, so I wanted to let everyone know. <laughs> I don't really post on Snap all the time because I've kind of gotten to a point in my life where I don't feel the need to post everything. Like I used to post all of my meals, like everything, every time I went shopping or went somewhere. But I don't know. That's just kind of where I'm at with social media. Like I said, I try to post to promote my YouTube. As you guys could see, the only thing on my story. But yeah, that's how I'm feeling. <laughs> and here's my snap quote if you guys wanted to add it. 
As for TikTok, I really don't go on here too much, but here's a little bit of my For You page. That's one of my favorite YouTubers, Lissette. Anyways, yeah, I go on here when I'm, like, bored. I was on it a lot in the beginning of quarantine, but I just haven't been on there too much. If you guys want to follow me, there you go. I don't really post a lot. I know it looks like I do, but I just got back on there recently. Here's me and my boyfriend. It's pretty embarrassing. <laughs> but, yeah, that's my little uh, TikTok page. And as for Visco, we love it. I use it all the time to edit my pictures. Haven't been on there as much as I used to. I used to go on it all the time, like as people do with TikTok now. I was that person. But anyways, here's a little bit of my feed if you wanted to see it. There's my username. I think my bio is really cute. Living the life I love and loving the life I live. Sounds great, I know. But here's a little bit of this feed thingy. I don't know what they call this. But I don't even follow half of those people. But yeah, I just use it to edit my pictures. And yeah, Visco is my go-to. And of course, another app, YouTube. I've gone back into YouTube a lot. As you guys could tell, I've been trying to post as much as possible. Um, yeah, I've been loving YouTube. Some of my favorite YouTubers, Adeline Morin, Alicia Marie, Lissetti. Um, I've also been getting into TK. Um, I never watched her, but she's like thriving right now and she's so entertaining. And here's a little bit of my page. And I just want to thank you guys because my channel has been growing pretty solid. And I'm so grateful <laughs> for everybody that watches my videos. I really appreciate it. And it's just a lot of fun putting out content for you guys. And if you have the update, they kind of gave you like an app library. So we don't really have to keep our apps on our home screen anymore. But now I'm just going through showing you guys some of my apps here. Some of my food apps. I swear by the Dunkin' app because you guys, if you didn't know, you could do your orders online. It saves so much time. And you get points towards free drinks. So that's always a fun time. Here is this app called CoStar. I used to go on it a lot. Not as much as I used to, I would say. But I'm really into astrology and my horoscopes and all that. But yeah, that is my iPhone 11. Hope you guys liked it. Alright guys, so that is it for today's video. I hope you liked it. And yeah, like I said, I don't have much of a crazy theme on my phone. But I just want to show you guys everything on there. Give you some app suggestions. And yeah, let me know what you think of voiceovers. Or if you like when I physically like show you. And like talk things thoroughly out you know but yeah so that's my new iphone <laughs> hope you guys like the video leave any video requests down below and i think that is all i have to say love you guys a lot and i will see you in the next one bye